Hello everyone and welcome back again to another video. Here we are reviewing the jump starter pack for pretty much any kind of vehicle or a lawnmower. But uh mentally you know vehicle and looks like a boat. So it's also a charger for your tablet, Nintendo or a game console that you know uses a USB and you know you can do some camera system like GoPro and stuff like that. So here we're gonna check this out and see what it's all about do it for the gram y'all ready yes what's what's tomorrow a and what long, else a long trip Who's birthday cameron you excited yeah yeah six hours to go plus yeah. another 12 to walk All right, so let's go ahead and um, do the unboxing of this real fast. As you can tell, it's still new. Oh, I need to change that knife. Knife ain't no good. I got tired of opening a lot of boxes, I guess. So I'll put uh, the link for this down in below in the description. <coughs> so we gonna have let's see yep, this on this side. let's see right here yep, there it is open this comes in a pouch like so let's get it out <coughs> Here, manual, manual, oh, it's basic. Um, USB with a USB C on the other side for charging it. Then, here we got the connectors, here are the clamps, positive, negative. This will tell you the voltage, and it only goes in one way. And also, it has this fail safe, or I guess if you put negative to positive and positive negative it's not gonna do anything it's not even gonna pass through uh this is a cigarette lighter you can plug in on the side uh with it it's got a little like a little three millimeter jack or something like that uh, on the actual charger itself so you can like plug in a cigarette charger for you know whatever <coughs> let's see we got the actual device over here so yeah, it's a jump start pack. There you go. Alright, so take this out. Woohoo. And then here we go. <coughs> it's got a flashlight. I think I believe you gotta press and hold the power button, which is right here. This is the little slot right there. When you plug this in. Once you plug again, it's gonna read. It's gonna start trying to read on the other side, the voltage, it will tell you the voltage. Uh, here's an output for a fast charger. I believe this is, what is it like? Uh, three or something like that. Here's a regular 2.1 or something like that. Uh, the regular standard charger. So this is the fast charge, that's the slow charge blue and black and then on the side is the where you plug in the USB-C it will do um, charge something else also through here like the Nintendo switch has a USB-C for the other side I believe no take that back um there's some devices that has or some cables that actually have two two USB-C's on both sides but those are very really rare I've never seen those in the devices that I've actually purchased. So plug this in, 
and obviously you gotta have a fast 20 watt I believe they said uh, usually like a iPad Pro big block chargers I think those are like 20 or 30 output um, anything above 15 it does not come with it that is the only downsize but usually you have chargers because you should have a brand new device no more than two three years old if you have a device that is older than three four years old you might want to go buy you some um it needs to be at least a 15 and up um if you look for the devices it'll tell you on there um i'll link down below uh, a couple ones that uh I've, I've used in the past um there's actually a box and i believe it comes with a charger cable for like a iphone at harbor freight it's got two usbs and it's a really fast charger so you can use that for this and then charge something else also as it's charging this this charge really quick um to be honest this is my second one um i just never did a review on the other one because i wanted to test it out first for you guys so i've had that for about let's say about eight to ten months now so i bought it at the beginning of the year i think it was like right at the end of january maybe February, but somewhere around that time at the beginning of the year it's pretty much october so i'll take about probably like seven eight months but it's more than six months and see right now it comes with 72 right there so this right here if i leave it charging overnight it won't take long and it holds this 72 for a while like if last time you used it it says 72 come back like a week two weeks close to three weeks and that will not move this if you have it a full charge i say my 16 gt mustang if you jump that one for any reason maybe three four or five times back to back it, it won't even reach 80 probably reaches like 89 87 somewhere around there do it about three four times this thing will do a lot of jumps it will not give you constant power like a old stone jump starter battery pack like them big boxes like the waltz and about this tall and very bulky so it will not keep a constant charge if you're trying to like test something like some lights or or any kind of thing that you know that you wanted to constantly draw out of this it will notice that it's drawing constantly and it will cut it off you pretty much have to unplug it from up here this right here you will have to unplug it and then plug it back in it will not keep that constant charge like a lawnmower let's say for instance you keep trying when 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 trying to get it started because you think it's the battery but at the same time it's the battery plus there's something else it's an issue it's more than one thing that is wrong with that lawnmower and if you keep using this to try to jump start it it will know that you're you're drawing a lot so it's it's gonna cut off power for that this is for emergencies it's got a flashlight i think even stroves you just press and hold it a couple times i believe just press and hold like two seconds it'll come on press and hold it again it'll flash strove and then press and hold it again and it'll turn off so you watch there it is I guess I guess I was wrong I'm sorry it does not do the stroke but at least it's got a flashlight it's pretty pretty bright if you're outside in the dark again I've used it several times over six months and it is I believe 2400 somewhere around there um MAs so it's got a big output so if you want to use it as a power bank you can and also as a jump starter so I'll usually leave mine here on this side obviously and then the cable usually I just throw it in here or underneath the charger just because sometimes he wants to come out with the rest of the stuff this right here I should usually throw it in there I already slides in stays in there I see it again Manuel Everything's on online anyways for it, but this is from an Amazon purchase for a trip. 
that there will be a video for that reveal of the trip for our family and once again thanks for watching and leave a comment down below and if you want to get you one of these there'll be a link down below in the description for the identical one um usually they sell out for a while usually they have sales they're somewhere between 55 sometimes sometimes to regular price which is like 80 bucks but something similar to this in a higher brand it's usually double the money so again i've tested this trust me i've tested this and tested this and tested this and well now i have two so thanks again don't forget to click the bell and comment and like and follow us on instagram okay l coyote and a underscore between the words thanks